All right, ladies and gents, welcome back to Zero Dark Nerdy, the world's most notorious pop culture podcast. This is your boy, Brian, a.k.a. El Nino, and today I am joined with... It's your boy, Freakin' Rican. What's good, man? Boricua all day. Puerto Rico, I got your back. 717 all day. PA, let's go, y'all. Yep. That's right. That's right. right. Love this guy. We've been posting about him now for about the last couple months. You, yes, you may not know him by name, but you will. I'm sure you've seen the videos. <laughs> hysterical, hysterical content creator, you know, especially dealing with how us Hispanics can mention names every now and again. As yep, you mentioned, yep. 717 Southern Pennsylvania. Uh, again, mm-hmm. Freakin' Rican on Instagram. Over 200,000 followers. I'm sure we're going to get to 2 million here shortly, my friend. Uh, uh, I don't know. We'll see, man. It's she- kind of slowing down a bit. But I mean, it's weird. It's like a roller coaster. It goes up and down, up and it down. Does. Me, but it does. It does. It did. Went, it went. It went pretty fast. I ain't gonna lie. It went pretty fast. I don't know how that happened, but yeah. thank God. Well, you know, I'm, I'm glad you mentioned that because I wanted to ask. It seems like you kind of just bursted on the scene here recently. And, yes. And, and how did it? You know, how did the how did the idea come about? And how has it been feeling to see people? You know, I'm sure going from maybe like five or ten likes in your first couple posts to now it's in the thousands. Yeah, um, so it's crazy because I've been on Instagram for a long time, right? Um, but the thing is, I had it like a personal account, yeah, you know, a personal page, whatever. And um, I started posting my my because I come from TikTok, right? Yeah. So on TikTok, I got like a good amount of followers. I got like almost half a million followers on TikTok. Okay. And um, so I tried to transfer on, on Instagram, but I noticed the algorithm was very different. And I'm like, dang, it's hard, and I could never blow up on there. Yeah. And I kept telling people, man, I don't like Instagram, man. It's too hard, man. It's too hard for me, man. <laughs> but now, um. Long story short, um, two months ago, I think it like beginning of July and of June, mm-hmm. my videos, one of my videos, the NFL video, like yeah. blew up. Hey, primo, get that key. Who's team Texan? Yeah. And then when I noticed that people liked that video, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna keep doing NFLs. I can do NFL videos. Yeah. And all the, all the NFL videos got over a million views. Yeah. Like every every single matter of fact, I think almost every sport ones like the basketball, NFL, MLB. Got a million views. Hey, it's Aki, ultimo. Philadelphia, Simoning Sister. Y it's Aki, the other team of the NBA in New York, Brooklyn Ness. Y it's Aki, Cisanati Bagels. Um, millions of views, I mean. Yeah. And um, so I just it's like a ripple effect so i noticed that okay they like sport videos so i'm gonna keep yeah. doing sport videos and that's what helped me out i mean to blow nice. so, yeah nice. so two months ago i was actually at believe it or not i was at 1600 followers wow yeah wow goodness gracious yep. and I mean, i'm glad you said that too because you're yeah. an inspiration to a lot of us out there i mean you know as uh-huh. a podcast we're five years in and as many as many listens as we get you know just like you said instagram i feel is like untouchable unless you're a celebrity for the most part yeah you it's hard. I mean? like tiktok it can get easier the more that you post you know there's yeah. a rhythm there's a rhythm to tiktok we have a local yeah. influencer here and he hates being called an influencer a local creator here named kenny who's a bartender i i, I feel like you hate that too i understand him i understand him. <laughs> yeah he doesn't want to be called an influencer so I, i'm gonna call you a content creator Yes, yes, so, yes. Yeah, he he feels the same way. He and he loves TikTok, and he's like, man, Instagram and, and Facebook is is on some other shit. Now, there's definitely a different ballpark. Like I said, I was a ten minute on Instagram, yeah. and, and it's just like I always had like bad luck, and then like I said, two months ago it just changed. I don't know. Wow. So, yep. So how long how long have you been doing? You know, I know you said once you noticed the NFL once took off. What was yeah. that? Just like a few, I feel like everything has happened this year for the most part, just from what I've seen on your posts. So how long, like me, how long I've been doing content? How long I've been doing? Or just, content? you know, as far as the, the recent, you know, success rate that you've been writing as oh, far as okay. you know, hits and followers and all that. So, I mean, like I said, I've been doing it. Oof. So I'm going to rewind it back, right? Yeah. I've been on TikTok for over three years. Okay. And, um, I have beef for TikTok, all right? Like, I, I used to get, like, reported a lot. I don't post bad videos. It's not inappropriate, yeah. but it was like a hater is, used to report on videos. And even if I, um, how you say, even if I appeal it, I still would lose. And I'm like, what the heck is going on? Yeah. But, um, so, yeah, and then on Instagram, like, two months ago, that's when it happened. And then, I don't know, like I said, I just, I can't really explain it because it's weird, yo. It's like, yeah. so I, what I felt like, okay, I feel like if I finally start hitting the algorithm. Yeah. And, 
And once I noticed that I was doing that, yeah. then I started reeling in like, okay, I'm gonna get them more. I'm gonna get them more. I'm yeah. gonna get them more. And then surprisingly, every, every week, and this happened, it don't happen anymore. It, it's like, like I said, it's like a roller coaster up and down, all right? So I wanna say like a month ago or so, like every week, like two or three of my videos get a million views. And um, it was crazy. I'm like, yeah, what's going on? Like, and I'm like, yo, this is crazy. Right. And um, it's just, I don't know. It was just happening. Now, now it slowed down a bit. Okay. But um, like I said, it all, hopefully it picked back up. Usually it does. So yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, I, I, you know, I, you know, just speaking kind of to it, what I tell people all the time when they ask me about podcasts and social media and things like that, yeah, I always tell them, I'm like, look, you know, you get a post. I, it's always random. Like, I, I'll get a post that has nothing compared to you by any means but you know <laughs> we'll, we'll get you know 50 or 100 likes and yeah. i'm like this is probably one of the worst posts i think of i've done and then i have a post where i'm like this shit is straight fire and it gets maybe a handful you know yeah. I mean? so i'm that like just, just put out there what you can yeah that that definitely happens to me a lot yeah a lot i like 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 i didn't think like i don't know if you've seen the x-men one Oh yeah, like that one. I didn't think I got over four million views. I didn't yeah. think that was gonna happen. <laughs> okay, it's a bean duro. It's a whoa whoa bean. Yeah. I like you know what? It's just a little funny one. Let's do it. Yeah. And I don't know where it just blew up. And then I did something I thought was gonna get a lot of views, but it didn't. You know what I mean? It just right. You just can't think that way. I used to think. No. I mean, I still do. I ain't gonna lie. I'm guilty yeah. of thinking that. But um, it sucks because I put on so much work. Yeah. Right. Doing it, editing my videos. Yeah. And you know you don't get a lot of views. And then right. when I go, you know, I'm just gonna post whatever. I'm just gonna edit a little bit, whatever, and post it, and then you get yeah. mad views. Like yeah. I don't know what's going on. Oh, so yeah. it's, it's very, it's, it's weird. The algorithm is is weird. It's like yeah. hard to understand. It, it really is, and they change they change it up so much, and that's why I just tell people I'm like, you know, I used to get bummed out. Where I'm like, gosh, why isn't why isn't it growing in this any other? And I'm just like, you know what? I just got to roll with the wave. Just keep doing what I've been doing. I've been doing this for five yeah. years. Like I got the listens, got everything else. If I don't blow up on social media, like I get it. But uh, you mentioned you do a lot of this at work. So are are yeah. your friends on there? Like there there are a lot of your coworkers. Yeah. So most of the people, all the people on my videos are my coworkers. Yeah. Okay. I, okay. Um, and and yeah, it's just. It just be down, I mean, and then yeah, not like then I always be down to do videos. Sometimes they'd be like, ah, I don't want to do it today, so I have to find which one to do it, you know. <laughs> right. Um, but but I don't right. beg, like I don't I don't beg. Yeah. At least I try to beg, but um, and um, yeah. So I'm like, hey, I don't remember I tag you in, and if you go, if I go viral, I mean, you go viral. But <laughs> thing about my coworkers, what what they don't understand is um, in other words, okay, how do I say this? I'm throwing them alley oops, right? Alley oops. Yeah. But they're not dunking the ball; they're missing the dunks. Yeah. If we're going viral, dude, start making content yourself. Right. Because that's gonna help you in the long run, but don't don't pick it back off me. I mean, which is fine if you want to keep doing that. Right. But don't get mad. I mean, when I go viral and and, and then um, I get benefits out of it. You feel me? Right. So right. it is what it is. If they see they're not a crap. I mean, but um, <laughs> no, so it, it is. it's a thousand percent real. I mean, I've been doing this five years, and as much as I love my podcast mates, I'm not talking anything about them. But it's like, look, you got to put in what you get out. You know, yeah. everybody wants to be a part of the videos. Yeah, that's cool. But, and I've, I've told every single one of them, and I truly believe this, I started this podcast because I believe you guys can all, and gals, can do your own thing in one day. And I still believe that. So I, I get where you're coming from on that. So we're very, yeah. very similar on that. So what, yeah. you know, what, it, like, how did you just kind of persevere that yourself? And what advice do you give to people? Like, just go out there and do it? Yeah, I, I don't know. If, uh, the first thing, okay, it's going to start a cliche because it is. Yeah. But the most important thing is your niche, right? Yeah. Which is funny. Speaking about niche, I used to say niche. Yeah. And I, I wasn't niche. I'm a niche, my niche, you know. I'm, <laughs> I'm a niche. And I never knew it was called niche. Yeah. I was looking really stupid, but not. Nah. Yeah. So you have to find your niche, right? Yeah. And um the, the lucky part about me is um when I started on TikTok, matter of fact, I didn't want to go on TikTok. I was like, it's for little kids. I'm right. not doing that for little kids. I see little kids right. dancing, doing whatever, <laughs> and stupid trends. But then I said, like, you know what, I'm gonna try it. Yeah, and um, the second day one of my videos went viral. Literally the second day. Yeah, and oh, but it was a whole different video. It, was, it wasn't a pronounced one. It's a whole different yeah. thing. And um, I didn't find out. I didn't find my niche. I want to say until like a year later. Yeah, and then I didn't start blowing up that much on TikTok until a year and a half ago. Right. Right. Um. Yeah. So I joined. I joined this community called Casa TikTok. Yeah. It's a community. Um. It was Latinx, and um, they yeah. accept anybody for me. And um, 
And, you know, I don't know. I, I, I'm my own community manager. So yeah. whenever they report my videos, I send it to her. She'll put it back up. Okay. If it's appropriate, which is ever inappropriate, someone with good. Yeah. It's just haters. They report your videos. Okay. Um, and, and, you know, I just feel like, uh, yeah, a year and a half ago is when I finally, like, actually, like, it changed. Like, when I really blew up. I went from, like, 87,000 to, like, 200,000. And right now, I'm, like, four or something. But it's going up slow, though. That's the only thing. Like I said, it changes. I mean, like, what it does. Like it does. But, I mean, to me, I think slow and steady does win the race, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Day, yeah. It's not like you're paying for it. You know what I mean? You're not getting like bots and all this stuff. So yeah, it, it is gonna, you know, work work out, obviously, and, and it has been. So um, you know, with, with that being said, have you know, with, with your especially very, very I wouldn't say very recent success, but you know, as yeah. you're getting followed and things yeah. like that, you know, especially in your area code, the seven one seven. You know, how yeah. has it been like going out in public? You've been getting recognized a little bit more lately. Like, yo. <laughs> so to be honest, not like that. No, no. Yeah. So I'm more recognized in different cities. It's weird. Okay. Like, like I get to invite to an event, like to Chicago. I went yeah. to a few events before. And like, I got, I got, I got recognized at Enterprise. I'm like, that's crazy. Like, yeah. and I, I got recognized in a festival and stuff like that. But over here, not much, not much. Like people <laughs> on my job, they know I'm just a regular dude, whatever. And then, right. like someone emails like, "Hey, what's up, chill? I'm married. I'm even chill with that, right?" But um, <laughs> uh, but no, it's just like locally. But 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 it comes to say, like you know that saying, you get more love inside of your city than you do in your city. Yeah, and that's the way I feel like was us as that's what's going on. So yeah. um, definitely, I get more recognized outside of city than I do in the city, which doesn't make sense. But right. it's right. the truth. So so speaking yeah. of which. You know, because on the on on your IG you have uh yeah. you have a link out there, but I didn't see any merch on there. If if people yeah. do want to find merch for your particular brand, where can they go to get it? I know it's blind vision. Blind vision. It's spelled different. It's it's b l n d vision dot uh-huh. com, and um you'll see my shirts on there. Um, and if you need my link, just DM me, and I'll send you the link. Whatever. Um, but yeah, the merch is definitely was cool too. Though. All right. Okay. Now, yep. um, you know, you just dropped another episode today on New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How, how? I mean, just how is it when you when you're doing that? You know, I mean, I know you said it's a lot of your coworkers, but yeah, you look like you're looking like you have a great time, and I think that's the appeal to a lot of us, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's personality. Like, you know, I can relate yeah. to this not just because I'm Hispanic, but I'm looking at this, and I send this to a lot of my friends, whether you know hispanic white whatever and they're just like oh my gosh this this is hysterical because yeah. even they can't pronounce stuff that's spanish at the same time yeah. so you know like where especially i love the ones where you're doing like brands you're doing food i mean you yeah, yeah, do yeah. it all so where do these ideas just kind of come from and you're just like all right you know what we're gonna do this today let's go yeah so a lot of times i do get requests and i try to do people's requests okay uh, but but what I do, I don't know, like my brain's always working with content. Yeah. I mean, I think, like, what's gonna be funny? Let me so like I did the Nickelodeon ones. Um, I was like, let me do the Nickelodeon one. And I look at the name and then I try to what I do for my stuff, right? I write down a name and see how to pronounce it. And if if it sounds funny, then I do it. But if it did pronounce it pretty good, I'm like, nah, I mean it's, it's cool and I could do that, but I won't get a lot of views. Yeah. Um it's funnier when it pronounced it messed up and it's it's, it's way funnier and you get more views that way. So right. I do like like, yeah, so I try to do like two of them. Like, let's say I do like Nickelodeon cartoon and then Cartoon Network, whatever. Let's say it that way. Yeah. And I would have them pronounce the cartoons, and which was funny, I used that one. I mean, yeah. yeah. So it's a lot of work, but um, oh, yeah. but the most work is editing. I mean, editing was what takes me the longest. <laughs> but um, actual video itself is like five minutes. Yeah. Oh, I bet. And that's what I, you know, I, yeah. I have my, my beautiful daughter. I have a 22 year old, she's getting ready to be 22, and she helps me out with a lot of my video edits. And, uh, you know, I know you're getting ready to be a dad. And I got to tell you, I, yeah. know you, I know you've heard this a thousand times. <laughs> it goes by quick, my man. And be I heard. glad to enjoy it. Because when she was born, you know, we didn't have social media. We barely had pictures on our cell phones. So I have to go back and actually go through a lot of stuff. But long story short, you know, she's the one that keeps me in the loop a lot with a lot of things. She does a lot of my editing and she knows how much. And I'm sure you're the same way. Editing is a pain in the ass. It you know, is. Especially it is. When, when you're doing it. I mean... The best thing about it is it's not so much the 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 mispronunciation so much it's the da, 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 like the sound yeah, 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 and the, yeah, yeah. and the, like the little clips uh-huh. after. I yeah, mean yeah. That, that's so what that's makes it. Part. So that that's what okay 
the truth is that's what helped me blow up on Instagram. Yeah. So before Instagram, like before I stopped blowing up Instagram, I didn't do that part. Yeah. I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. So come to my ticket board at the football. They would say whatever New York Jets, whatever. Yeah. They would say New York Jets, whatever. New no, no, York Jets, yeah. and I laugh, and that's it. Oh, okay. So when I do it that way, I could do about ten teams, eight to ten teams. Yeah. So when I'm doing a new way, I do no more than six teams because I want to keep it like a minute long. Yeah. So um, the new way is just come to my ticket board and say it, and yeah. and I do my little laughing thing, whatever, and then that's when I before I laugh, I put that brum, 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 oh. whatever whatever video. You know what I mean. Como se llama este equipo de fútbol? New York, yes. <laughs> There's the so sound for the, for the for MLB or the sound for NBA or whatever, the yeah. music. And and that definitely, when I started doing that, yeah. on IG, that's when I blew up. I noticed yeah. that's what, so I basically pretty much I had to do my same content, but spice it up a bit. That's it. it of one thousand percent, because I think a lot of people think that they can just go out there and be Jake and Logan Paul and just do whatever. Like there, there's no matter who you are, anyone that that's decent at this, and just like you spoke to, you have to be good at editing the content. Yeah, you know I mean, I think that's that's definitely because I mean it's still funny, but the you know what makes it even funnier is the music in the background, and then yeah. how it, how you spell it, yeah. like say it, yeah. and then yeah. the image, like the the Ron yeah. Jeremy yeah. one today. <laughs> Jose Ultimo, Nueva York Ranger. <laughs> oh, bro. Yo, I was hoping they would get it. I'm like, what do you think it's going to get it? But it's yeah. like, um, um, Nueva York Ranger, Ranger, Ranger. I'm like, so that's the thing. So yeah. I have to, a lot of times, okay, it's funny. A lot of times they don't say what I write. Yeah. But since I wrote it, it sounds like they said it. Yeah. So I know a lot of people don't notice that, but yeah. I, I, if I write it, it sounds like you said it. I mean, <laughs> so long story short, when when they say Ranger, Ranger, I'm like Ranger, Ranger, what's the Ranger? The Ranger, 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 Ron Jeremy. Oh, yes. Ron Jeremy, Ranger. So boom, I yeah. look for a Google picture of uh, Ron Jeremy and put it up there. It's like Ranger, Ron Jeremy, right? It was so perfect. it's all my mind always moving, man. Yeah. It's always moving. And I mean, plus by doing that too, like you, you hit all of us that are like thirty and up. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I grew up. <laughs> Not, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know a lot of kids don't Jeremy, know who yeah. they are, so yo, if right. you, you don't know Ron Jeremy. You, you got kids Googling Ron Jeremy right now. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! So, okay. you know, one, one of the first ones that I saw from you, especially being a pop culture podcast, is the uh, Transformers one. You know, okay. so I just I just want to ask you, uh, yeah. you know, what what are some, some of the things that you're passionate about in terms of just movies, music, this, that, and the other? Like, what, what are you into, Jorge? So I actually like Transformer movies. Yeah. Like I'm not I'm not into like the comics and all like that. I don't really yeah. read comics like that. I can't even read. That's why. But um, uh, now nah, I'm not nah, nah, But now nah, um, I love Transformer movies, right? So yeah. the reason, one of the reasons why I did it that because I got invited to a Transformers um private screening, yeah. And I got to watch the new Transformer that came out, and um, I said, you know what? Uh, I will make a video and tag him. I mean, and then. Yeah, so I, I have to meet Anthony Ramos, um, the rapper. I forgot his name. To, Toby something. Oh yeah, uh, Toby. Yeah. Another another very yeah, hard, hard to pronounce yeah. name. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I got to meet them because of the, the premiere. And um, yeah. so when I did the video, I was hoping they post it, but I don't think they post it because it was Paramount Pictures. But the good thing is they do follow me on IG though. So yeah. So little by little, I might be start acting. You know what I mean? Hey, I, hey, we need, I, hey, we need more Spanish representation. I'm, I'm sure you follow nah, John Logazamo on IG. Nah, for bro. real, but I, I can't act. I'm too real, bro. I can't act, man. I'm not. Hey, I would act. I, mean, I, just, I never acted before. I mean, but you never know. Anything can happen. Anything's possible, bro. Anything is possible. I'm just one of those guys to where I, I feel like it'd be like, all right, cut. We can't get this <laughs> motherfucker to stop laughing. For like, especially if it's a serious <laughs> game. You know, I grew up getting my ass whooped in a Puerto Rican household with a chancla and everything. So. Yeah. It got chancla. to the point to where, you know, I was just laughing at it. And my mom was like, why are you laughing? The plants with that? Yep. Ooh, that but, um. I said another thing I do love doing, I ain't gonna lie, is yeah. gaming video games. I love Call nice. of Duty. Okay. Um not the new one anymore, but yeah. I like, like you know, the old school Call of Duty and stuff like that. And um yeah, and the music, I like I like I love rap. I could actually write songs and stuff like that too. Um okay. sooner or later I'm gonna come out on Instagram with some songs, all right? You're gonna have to wait, but it's gonna come out and I could actually write some pretty decent songs. So let's see, man. So uh, 
I'm excited about that. It's just nobody knows yet. Only my friends yeah. know what I mean. Hey. My family members. Hey. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let me Let's know. We will, be, we will be your biggest supporters, my man. Because I mean, I love. I love how you said it. You, we can literally do everything, you know. And yeah. I, like I said, I started this podcast because I just wanted my voice heard. And now I'm like, all right, well, maybe yeah. I'll start doing some video. So I started doing these little sixty uh-huh. second, you know, clips like your week, your podcast, your your podcast yeah. during sixty seconds. So I'm getting there. You know, it's a, it's a confidence thing too. On top of that, and I mean, on top of that, we are very big on mental health. Like I suffer from depression and anxiety. A lot of the oh. other people on our podcast do as well. So we also try to just make sure that we let people know, Hey, listen, you know, you're going to have haters out there. You're going to, I mean, I'm sure you got trolls, you know what I mean? Everybody's yeah. going to have haters and trolls, but you know what? These people aren't in your circle. These people yeah. aren't anything that you're about. This isn't family, yeah. whether blood or the family that we choose. And as Hispanics, yeah. you know, we are very serious about that shit. I tell people all the time, I'm like, my family is my family, but then my inner circle, that's also my family, too. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. That's how it is, man. That's how, and you know, it's crazy to speak about that, um, about mental health. So my wife, she's a family therapist, so she deal with mental health. Um, yeah. I feel like if I was to have, like, stuff like that, I think she would help me out. So I'm blessed with her. I mean, so, but yeah, um, that's definitely, mental health is a serious thing, y'all. So take it serious, y'all. If you see somebody stressing out or depressed, talk to them, man. Let them know they love, man. That's how I see it, man, for real, for real. I love it. Yeah, man. Love it. Jorge, I think that's a great way to end this episode. You have been phenomenal as, as a fellow <laughs> Rican to another fellow Rican. I want to see nothing but success out of you. Thank you, man. Representing Southern PA. I got to ask, you know, are you, uh, you, you a Philadelphia Eagles fan? 100%. And I'm not a Philadelphia Eagles fan. I'm a Philadelphia Eagle fan. <laughs> oh, Who I gotta, that? I got I to gotta bring it out real quick. This is the Randall Cunningham sign helmet. I'm bird gang till I die, baby. Yeah, let's go. I knew yeah. I like you, man. Yep. Oh, yeah. We're, we're going to get along great. Oh, I almost forgot, too. Yo, question. Pregunta, yeah. ¿tú hablas español? Yo hablo un poquito. Yo entiendo mucho, pero okay. hablo un poco, which is so, no, because that was my first language. Ah, no, it's, no my, my Spanish is not that great either. Um, so, <laughs> no, your Spanish is way better than mine. Pero te voy a dar algo. Okay. Do you want me to pronounce celebrity, hard celebrity name? Oh, yes. Yeah. See, see, see. see. Ah, <laughs> see. Come on, bro. I'm going to send you this video, but don't embarrass me too much on there. So, yes. Nah. All right, let me let me, let me me pull it up here real quick. Give me one yeah. second. I got to do the screen share as well. All right. So, let's see. Huh. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, let's go wow. ahead and start. Yep. I know. I mean, it does get a little bit easier. It does get a little bit easier, but, you know, just wanted to go ahead and see where you're at. So, you got six actors and actresses. Wow. And I want to hear how, how you, and I, I, hey, to, if it makes you feel better, I probably will do a worse job trying to pronounce their names. Nah, it's all good. I'm down. I'm going to try, all right? Okay. Sa, I see Sa, oh, Sa, oh, what the heck? Sarise Ronan. Hey, I, I think that's close enough. I'm pretty sure it's Sarose Ronan, but I mean, it's, it's, it's right there in there. Sersha Ronan. I'm pretty sure it's Sarose Ronan. <laughs> Wow, that, <laughs> and we could wow. both be wrong. We could both be wrong. All right, now you got now you got a double whammy here. Wow, dude. Uh, um, I know that's that. Uh, it looked like Satch, but it's Sack. Uh huh. Galafina. Sack. Um, Galafina. Sack. Galafina. Then. Galafia Naski. Zach Galifianakis. Come on now, dog. Zach Galifianakis. Close. What in the Close world? Up. Oh my God. He's from, he's from down here. He's from the South. So, yeah. yeah I know. I, I, know who weird last names. I never knew his last name, bro. Like, I, I, it was too hard. Wow. And this guy, um, dude, I'm, I'm definitely um, Puerto Rican. Um, but, um, Chiwetel Elo for. I, I think that's that's damn near close. That's what I would have guessed, to be honest with you. Chiwetel Ejio for. Let's go. I'm pretty sure it's uh, uh, Eo Four. sounds right. His first name. I don't. I don't even want to try to butcher it even more. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I, their names is crazy. Okay, so this one is Famke Jansen. Yep. 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 Famke Jansen. Correct. And he like Joe Queen. <laughs> yes, Queen. <laughs> uh, Joe Queen Phoenix. 
Not bad. Not bad. Now you. I'm pretty sure it's Joaquin. Joaquin Phoenix. I mean, it's all right. Like. Yep. Yep. All right. Last one. And I saw this one and I was like, I don't even know this girl. I'm just okay. interested to see how you would pronounce it. Oh, wow. Okay. I know the last name. It seems like Wallace. Wallace. <laughs> yep. Wallace. Yep. Wallace. I don't know. Wallace. But. Quev. Quevzane. <laughs> you you've been saying you've been saying what? that's hard. What is that, bro? I, I would say if, if I'm gonna guess right now, I'm gonna say Quanine, and the V and the Z are silent. This is how you say my name. Quanine. Oh, <laughs> okay. I go like, like I can't pronounce a lot of things. Like, yeah. There's a lot of things I can't pronounce, and um, I just do my content like I said, just because people think it's funny. In reality, do I can't talk that. I and I, I, like I said, I'm I'm the same uh, way. Real dog, I be messing up a lot of things, bro. And I mean, yeah. And my wife be like, come on, yeah. now you should know what he's saying. I'm like, yo, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm Puerto Rican, Puerto Rican. That's, That's right. Like, we got a cool. language, anyways. Yeah, it's I know. Literally no, speak no. English. That was fun, man. That's definitely that was fun, man. Yeah, like thank you so much. Seriously, uh, I I cannot thank you enough for joining me on this episode. Yeah.